<coughs> Hi, everybody. It's me, Jordan here, and today I'm going to talk about dealing with PMC Bank or dealing with any bank that you may have an account with or going to make an account with. There always seems to be these protocols that you go through, Jordan says. Now, I get it. The protocols are there for a reason. But usually, there's always the first thing that most people don't like, but it usually gets done. Now, since banks pretty much are victims of either robberies or stick-ups or, or whatever, most people, uh, most banks have security officers and usually the first thing you usually encounter is them when you come in. Um, it always seems to be like the original routine. Now I don't know if it gets boring or anything for them, but if they gotta keep on asking people the same questions every time they come in, I mean imagine how boring that must be. But imagine how how imagine their surprise if someone came in and had all those weapons on them. Then their then their job would not have been as much boring as it was. It's like this. Do you have any firearms or any other concealed weapons on you? No, I don't. Well, that's good. You can go in now. I mean, seriously, Jordan said, as a security officer, you're pretty much taking people at their word. I mean, what if someone lies and then goes in there and has either some type of con de concealed deadly weapon? I mean, that would look really dumb. You're basically taking people at their word. Now, airports don't take people at their word. Airports used to do that and idiots used to then sneak their weapons in and out. So airports usually have multiple security checks and scannings. But at a bank, pretty much they're just taking you at your word. Now, Jordan says, the fun part is pretty much over. Because now you gotta wait in line and wait for a teller or wait for a, I guess you call it an account officer, whatever term you give to someone who's in charge of making accounts. Or something like this. And the funny thing is, Jordan says, they always seem to have multiple pens to give away. I mean, it's so funny. I mean, they always seem to have all these free pens like, here, here's PMC Bank's pens. We give these away as free gifts. I mean, it might not, it might only cost us a dollar just to produce, you know, but here it goes. So, what do you want today? How can I help today? Well, today, Jordan said, I have to deposit a check. And why? Because the people who, one motion picture or advertising agency I worked for, didn't want to sign off direct deposit between you and their bank. Aw, uh, that's a pain in the butt. I'll do that for you. And while a person's doing all, while a teller's doing all of that stuff, or the loan officer's doing all that stuff, or when whatever the account officer's doing their things, um, or account administrator, what are, what are job title to give these people? Um, it's always funny, because at the end, they always give out the pens. I mean, they go like this. All right. Your check has been deposited into your account. I really think that we, I think that our bank, us and their bank would have signed off on direct deposit if they actually had the time. Well, I remember, I remember signing out the paperwork, Jordan said, but those goofballs didn't want to sign off on their end. Well, okay, here's a, I'm um, sorry about that. Here's a bunch of pens you can have. Give them to your friends, your family. Your, your 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 classmates, your your co-workers, hell, give them to your pets. Boom. Next thing you know, next thing you know, Jordan said you got so many PMC Bank uh, pens that have their logo on it. You don't know what to do with. I mean, that always seems to be the funny part. At the end, the banks always seem to give you these gift pens. They have them all over the place. I know they use them, and I know it costs them. 
to get them made, maybe a dollar probably. And the pens are probably made in some third party manufacturer that is located either in Vietnam or China or something like that. And the people are only getting paid like maybe, maybe minimum wage to produce the pens. But why does PMC Bank always give away so many pens? It's crazy. But I sure all banks do this. Citizens Bank, Cities Bank, Commonwealth Bank, Bank of America, Dollar Bank, Mellon Bank, Hepperton Bank, you name it. The first Commonwealth Bank, you name it. They all give away their pens. Uh, okay, so that's it. That's me, Jordan, said doing my video dealing with PMC Bank. Hope you all enjoyed this video, and I'll see you all later.